Hello everybody and welcome back to The Witcher 3. Here we are on the quest position again in the haunted house where we're trying to save Ulderic. So let's go in and see where there's anything else. There must be something else. Yeah, there's literally got to be something here that we can examine. I mean, w w ideally... What can we actually do with this thing? Yeah, but well, well, there's something to examine. Hmm. Siri. No, it's impossible. Damn it. Looking to discourage me? Good. Means you're scared. Hmm. Shattered. Udelric must have been scared of seeing the creature just behind him. Alright, well, let's see what else there is. There's this thing here. But I don't know. Uh, Solid oh, craftsmanship. Fitter must have been from the continent. Here's another room. It's a cold cradle. Must have belonged to Udelric or Aki. Oh, okay. Where else have we got to look? Geralt, come! Think I've got an idea! Let's go see what she's thought up. Oh, there's a wall. Come up with anything? Yes, I have a plan. One that just might work. Can I get any details? You've got to wait for me here. I won't be long. Uh, anything else? Said yourself, you can't know the details. So no, nothing else. You simply got to trust me. Well, <laughs> hope you know what you're doing. We don't really have a choice. So do I. So, can we start? Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm ready right. whenever. All right, I'll be back soon. In the meantime, get a fire going in the oven. She's running to the old house. Grab her. Take him. You must put him in the oven. Trust me. What the fuck? Take care not to hurt the child. Give me the face. In the oven. Throw him in the oven. Oh god. We don't really have a choice, do we? Hmm. We the Witcher him. committed no crime. You'll find neither despair nor guilt here. Only shock and relief. You've been tricked. You must go. Well, 
We did it. It's over. Over? We tricked the Heim. It thought I'd killed your child, abandoned you to haunt me, feed on my conscience. But when it saw the babe was whole, unharmed, it had to go. You're free, Jarl. Free? The Heim's gone. So are the voices that tortured you. Let's get out of here. Yep, let's do that. What's happening? My head's spinning. I'm spinning in a maelstrom. Geralt, you said it was over. That's just fatigue. In time, his mind will return to normal. What? What will I do now? Hmm. You'll be fine. Key is to not give in to self pity. I feel as if someone's torn something from me. That's normal. The Heim was a parasite. Bonds between parasites and hosts can be strong. That's why you feel empty now. Give it a few days, weeks, you'll be fine. Thank you. I think. Farewell. Well, we'll be able to help the arm, and fingers crossed, this should be the last thing we ever have to do in the Isles of Skellige. Because the weather's shit. I'll go with him. He seems confused. Hmm. Good idea. Then what? What are your plans? I'll stay a few days, make sure he's healthy. And you? Gonna stay on Speaker Rock? Don't know yet. Gotta gather my thoughts. I'm sure Yennefer must be grown impatient. Thought we already discussed that. We did. Farewell, Witcher. Favorable winds and following seas to you. To you too. So long. Dumb. Help us solve a matter of accession to the Skellige Prime. Is that um literally the last quest? I mean, let's hope that's not the one. Let's have a look. So we've got brothers in arms. Help resolve the matter of the second succession. Um. Well, we should go back there and do that. That's literally all we need to do now. So report back. Hopefully, there's a fast travel point. Yes, there is. Must be a far shot point down in this little village. It's for lag. Yeah, it must be because I travelled here before. Watch it. There we are. There we are up in this for lag, and we need to go to here, to the bridge. Oh, we're gonna sneeze again. <coughs> oh my god. Hay fever is really a fucking pain, especially when you're trying to record. I mean, you get watery eyes and everything. Who's this guy? Master Geralt, a guard spotted you from the tar. They sent me to open the gate. Why was it closed? Is that famous Skellige hospitality? Me. Is tradition. After the feast, the Jarls will choose the king, so the doors must remain closed. Only the sons and daughters of Skellige may stay in the castle. Mm -hmm. Guess you made an exception. Croc make an exception just for me? All know what you did for Ceres and Yalmar. Today, you're one of us. Come. Croc awaits. How's the mood in there? Can it run? Too calm. How's that? We've been at it here in Skellige. At a good feast, meat and blood flow in equal measure. Surely you consider this barbaric on the continent, no? Not sure. Sounds preferable to dull banquets garnished with court intrigue. Now. I 
I've as much right to it as you do. And I'd expect you to support me, not pinch my allies. If an on crates to wear the crown, it... It should be you, because you've got fur growing on your chin, that it? Show some of your own, and the Jarls just might listen to you. Watch your mug smacked. Remember, I was left standing last time we crossed fists. <laughs> yeah? So you'll fight the Vilkarls with me? Wonder who'll do better? You? Or Yalmar, the giant slayer? Oh, stop your shite boasting! Ceres! Hey! Ah, damn it! Bad way to play it out. Think I don't know that? But you saw her. She's so. so. My stubborn, fierce, mule headed. Refuses to listen to anyone. Exactly! <laughs> <laughs> True, Arnvald. Me and Cyrus. They're twins in that regard. Oh, where's Krach? Don't see Krach. He talked me to the Arles. No, went to his chambers. To prepare your promised reward, no doubt. If you've a spell, Witcher, perhaps you'd fancy some fifty cups with the Vilkarls. Loosen up your joints after your journey. Maybe later. You know that that you Not you, nor that witch! Yet. Come on! Where these goblins want us to Wait a minute, who's that is she talking my who's that talking? Oh, did I just run straight into a boxing ball? Guess we distracted him. Take a look. Still got all my teeth. Most of them did quite a number on you. Why are you laughing? They'd have trashed you too. <laughs> Doubt it. That's so. Care to wager on it? Drop any one of the veiled cars, and I'll give you my sword. End up like me, you part with yours. Hmm. Let's find out first who they are. Carls. Who are they? Ah, uh, wild men. Live in the hills. Shepherds, then? Aye, without the sheep. They live off killing, eat only what they hunt, and they fight like no one else. Let's do it. You're on. Start wrapping that sword for me. Don't sell your fish till they're in the boat, wolf. I want to fight Egghead. You're taking on challengers in fist fights. Challengers? Nah, nah. Ain't none a challenge to us. We're here to hit. Hit till our fists are red with blood. Let's do this. Gladly. How many of them are we taking on, brother? Well, how long are you gonna make me wait? It's quick, quick punches, quick punches, quick punches. You can't do anything. I can knock this guy out. One heavy punch, come on. Come on. He's down. Knocked him out. You had good. Hard. I'm a witcher, that's what we're meant to do. Smacked his gob so hard it's a wonder his brain didn't fly out of his ears. Well, lost the wager. But that was such a spectacle, I don't even mind. Here, may it serve you well. Is it gonna just be a really crap sword as well? 183 to 220. Impotent chance to freeze, armor piercing. To be fair, it's better than this one, damage wise. Hmm. I mean, we can get rid of that one. It's, it's a better weapon, regardless, to the point of. 
How? Why is it? Why is Helmar's sword better than the ancestral sword of his family? It just doesn't make sense. Greetings, Berna. Feast not to your liking. This is no feast. It's a farmer's market where votes are bought and sold like sheepskins. Hmm. Svanrig is not going to vie for support. Bran's son will not haggle for a crown that is his by right. Far as I know, crown goes to the claimant who gains the most votes. That is the tradition, but not all traditions are good. The Isle's care should be entrusted to a single family. What's wrong with voting for your king? Take a walk. Listen and you'll understand. The claimants already hand out land, promise privileges, titles, favorable judgments. They behave like whores lifting their skirts for every passerby. <laughs> a king by the grace of votes is no ruler, but a debtor. This must end. We must start by placing Bran's firstborn son on the throne. I hope the Yarls will see the wisdom of it. I wonder if she's leaving. Leaving Kertrolda? Tomorrow at daybreak. Enjoy yourself, Master Geralt. Hmm. May I? You must even come. I've been waiting for you. So, feast to your liking. Any better than your continental balls? Definitely more to drink. Ah, there is. Rolled all of it out of my cellars. Double meads, triple, cintrian plum brandy, a hot mm. spirit that burns the mouth like boiling water. Clan on crate knows the meaning of hospitality. Hmm. Promised me a reward for helping your children. And I aim to keep my word. Here. Yeah. This bauble's been in the family for generations. I give it to you for helping ensure the line endures. Another fucking sword. Beautiful craftsmanship. Thanks. I'm the one. Let's do it. Are we going to be just going straight in there? Oh my god. Let's just... Let's just freeze the bear. Bears in though. <laughs> like an assassination attempt. Cloth, give me some cloth. Gotta stop the bleeding! Quick! Da. Da. Take my cloak. <coughs> Hold on, son. You'll pull through. A shark grabbed my leg once. Albion! He's dead. Crack! Where'd those bears come from, huh? Answer! Now! Careful how you speak to my dad. Stow your blade, pup, or Crack will lose a son too. You insult me, Lugart, and now you threaten my son. I will not stand for this. Then come here. 
Come on! Put you down like a rabid dog! Calm down! Calm down! Enough blood's been spilt. Someone brought these beasts here to murder our sons and brothers. We cannot restore their lives. But we can. We must avenge them. This burden falls upon the host and his offspring. Hmm. He's got a point. Find the guilty on Craig. Find and kill them. Else your clan will be cursed for a hundred generations to come. Well, anybody see how the bears got in? Don't matter. I know where to find the guilty already. Wait, are you mad? You're gonna kill folk before we've learned what happened. Learn all you want. Meantime, I'll go wash the shame off our clan. Hey, the Yarls aren't listening anymore. Stop playing the hero and think for a second. Our honor's at stake, sis. That can't wait. Are you listening to me? Someone let those bears in. We must know who, and the answer lies somewhere in this room. Hmm. You're right, Ceres. I'll help you. Thanks. Fine. See you when I return with the traitor's heads. I'll stay here. Someone must see to everything. Summon the healer, hand the fallen over to their families. Wolf, I thank you. Damn. Ever see anything like that? No, and I hope I never will again. Where'd the bears come from? We were all laughing, eating, drinking. Suddenly, a massacre. Torrents of blood on the walls. Well, we we'll start with what happened, find massacre. out who died, and then go from there. Y young Lucas bet he could empty a barrel of beer in one go. He climbed on the table, grabbed a pony keg of centering wheat, and started chugging. His throat bulged like a blowfish. Face went red, but he kept drinking. Folks started banging their tankards on the table, shouted, Lugos, Lugos. Then, from the other side of the room, we heard this roar. We turned in unison as if a coxswain had called. They were there. They were already there. Folks closest to the bears didn't even manage to draw their weapons. They... They were ripped to shreds. We'll avenge mm. them, I promise. See you, know who died. Drogadar, Drakeborn Du, Blue Boy Lugos, Yalborn, Otrig. Take some time, mention them all. But you could name the claimants to the throne who survived in one breath. You, Yalmar, and Svanriga. What are you saying? Nothing, just yet. All right, it's good to be We've one talked of them. enough. Let's look around. Let me know what you find. I'll speak to the others. Maybe someone saw more than I did. So you see that they're supposedly the fiercest warriors in the in the in the lands in the whole of Temeria. Pain marks, but claw marks, no. broken bones. Jesus Hard to say what exactly killed him. Yeah, there's no way of knowing. I mean, how they managed to All right. not do anything against here. bears. Work away down. Bear's head, but the tongue's short, like a human's. Mouth smells of honey liqueur. Mead. And something else. Something earthy. Hmm. Bear's like honey. Before it's fermented. Strange. Something under the fur. A tattoo? Shape of a bear paw. Old scar. Looks like it was sutured. Hmm. Half man, half bear. Something like a lycanthrope. No full moon, so something else caused the transformation. Maybe something he ate or drank. Mead. Mead with an earthy aroma. Need to check the horns, tankards, and bowls. Okay. Well, 
Oh, that guy is alright. Ish. Let's see what we find here. Here. Mead spiked with some kind of mushroom and human blood. Ceres, come here. A guard saw what happened. Those weren't bears. They were... Men who transform into bears. Uh-huh. Berserkers. Berserkers? Berserkers. The skull's name for warriors who change into animals in the midst of battle. The stuff of fairy tales, legends. But it seems to make sense, right? Mm hmm Almost. We were at a feast, not on a battlefield. True. I think I know what caused them to transform. The mead they drank. Smell this. Mead spiked with blood and something else. Thinking it could be a mushroom, but I don't recognize the type. Sure, might help us. Few druids know herbs better. Can't hurt to try. True. Let's quickly examine the rest of the stuff around here. Is it all the same stuff? Yep. What's in here? Strawberries, there we are. Let's quickly have a look at this sword we were given. 279. Again, that's Igni sign intensity, Axi sign intensity, and Tarsh Hacker. I use Igni and I use Axi a lot. And I don't really use Ard. Charles Corp bleeding. Yeah, I don't really use them. So. That's a perfect weapon. Still r really, really weird as to why um, Kalmar's sword is supposedly better. Freya, our mother. May the sea swallow the traitors. Freya, our lady. Mind if I interrupt? Already have? What is it? Someone spiked one of the mead barrels with blood and something else. An herb or a mushroom. Sarah said, give me the horn. Let me just get it out of my rear pocket again. Where I carry absolutely a everything. A mushroom. Mardrom. Hmm. Mardrom related in any way to berserkers? Aye. But only in the tales told to children as they are put to sleep on cold winter nights. Warriors who ate Mardrom were said to transform into beasts when consumed by battle rage. But as I said, it's only... Only a legend, I know. Still, I find it easier to believe than some story about bears appearing out of nowhere. Sarah's wasn't lying. You know your fungi. I do. Especially those which affect the mind, soothe it, summon waking dream. Hmm. Odalric suffered for years. I tried to help him in various ways, initially with prayer, then with poppy milk. But he's done with that now, right? It's not that simple. But we'll wean him off it yet. Mardrum. Never heard of it. You have another name for it on the continent. Silasaib, I believe. All right. Peasants eat it to soothe pain. Udalric tried it too, but only a few times. In larger doses, the mushroom causes visions. Nightmares. Yes, the last thing Udalric needed more of. Thanks for your help. Blood and marjoram. The taste of human flesh and a substance that triggers visions. That well could have caused the rage. Exactly. Maybe even the transformation. Maybe. Hard to believe someone spiked the mead here in the hall, though, in front of all those witnesses. You're right. I helped prepare for the feast. I'd have noticed. It might have happened before they brought the drink upstairs. In the cellars, maybe? Come on, we could find some clues there. It's a good idea. Hmm. Come on, Ceres, come on. Yep, go, 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 come on, go, go, go. We must find the traitors quickly. Elsewise, the warriors will take matters into their own hands. The castle's a buzz already. Think they'd attack Krach openly? My father or each other? 
All in the finest Skellige tradition. Haven't had a good civil war in ages. Yeah, I'm still following you, woman. Knew there'd be trouble. It was all too calm. Funny. Arnvald said the same. For a feast to be any good, meat's got to flow. But so does blood. I'd say he got his wish. Hmm. I really hope Yalmar's doing something useful, not just looking for a fight. Relax. Your brother's impetuous, not stupid. We keep the poison at the cellar's other end down below. Come, I'll show you. Why do you store poison? <coughs> the stench! Is that vodka? The Hackerman spirit. Someone ruined several barrels of the finest. Good thing Dad's got other worries in his mind. Right behind you. That's a relief. Well, this one's been open. Blood and mushrooms. Think we can find out where this barrel came from? Looks different. What the? Shit. The spirit! There's another exit behind the barrels, but they're too heavy. We'll never move them. Don't intend to. Go. There's someone in there attempted to get us as well as we started to find them. What? We might have been burned alive. Somebody's damn desperate to bring our investigation to a quick end. Ooh, what is this then? This is a when Yalmar and I were little, we'd play here. Once ah, bygone days. Actually, draw from it. Oh, we need to hold, that's why. <laughs> Gained one ability point. It's a Quen one. Nope, it's not the right one, so I was hoping I could turn into a bear. When I get my hands on that pyromaniac. Let's think. They had to use the entrance we used. Maybe they left some prints behind. Maybe. When the door slammed shut and the fire broke out, did you hear a bottle shatter too? No, <laughs> but I've no witcher sense at my disposal. You must hear the hair growing on my head. <laughs> I try not to eavesdrop. Anyway, entrance is worth checking. Come on. She's very calm headed. Very. She thinks a lot. Yeah, I guess the entrance is worth checking. Someone walked through the mead. Hmm. <laughs> Silly person. Now, who do we think it might be? Off. Need to find another clue nearby. Someone must have felt his clothing rip, but was in a hurry. What's this? Piece of cloth. No, it can't be. What is it? Arnvald's tunic. Only he wears this kind. Sure about that? Saw him in the main hall with the servants. Let's go. Would we not take that piece to compare it? Been saying that he's going to have nothing on, isn't he? Not nothing. Catch on bolt. Grab a horse, we'll chase him down. <laughs> we know that he's storm. Oh, are we on are we on Roach? Iron Bolt! Stop, damn it! Doubt he'll listen. When I get my hands on him. You don't stand a chance. Oh. Where to see you bark that! Oh, we can get there. We need the stool sword. Oh my god, why did I stop? Why did I suddenly slow down? I have a quicker horse, yet I suddenly... suddenly slowed down. Let's cut the corners, cut the corners. Shit, he's fast. 
Is he, is he really there? What do you mean, got him? I did. Why do you betray them? Talk, or I'll finish what I started. No Oncrit should ever sit on Skellige's throne. I know you better than others do. You're hot headed, irresponsible. Skelliger needs stability, a strong king. Not the kind a band of drunken jarls will choose. Curious. Never heard you voice that idea, but I do know one who never stops saying it. It's Bernard Bran, isn't it? Hmm. You were never a good liar on vault. See. What was her motive? It's obvious. She schemed this up to get rid of the other claimants. Slander or clan in the process. If she succeeded, Spanrigger would have been left. The only claimant to Skellige's throne. Hmm. We do need proof. We need proof. Your word against Berna's, that's not enough. Anvald, help us, and I'll ask my dad to grant you an honorable death. I'll insist. I have letters from her. Instructions. How to poison the maid. Hmm. But she never signed them. There's no seal. Well, how do we know enough? this? It'll have to be. We shouldn't delay. Time to gather the orals. Gather everyone all in one hole. And they'd say, that's the guy. Go. I've assembled the Jarls in council as you demanded, Ceres on Crate. You claim to know who's behind the slaughter at Kaer Trolder. Speak then. The blood of Skellige's sons and daughters. Whose hands does it stain? Boona Brands. The lass is mad. Do you think anyone will believe you? You had them serve poison mead to the berserkers. I beg your pardon. The servants of Kaer Trolda are not mine to command. It was your father who called for the feast who assembled the guests. There's reason in these words. Have you any proof to confirm your accusation? I've better. I've a witness. Arnvald. Zerus speaks true. Bernard commanded me to poison the maid. When Zerus and the Witcher descended into the cellars, who betrayed us? The clan that took you in? Good hmm. man. He's a servant to Ancreate, a lackey. He will say what they command him to say. He would lie for them even were he to pay for it with his head. Bernard speaks true. Arnvald has served at Kaer Trolder ever since I remember. Doily, look a dog. I can vouch for Ceres. She's telling the truth. You? Yet another uncreate lackey. But I'm a Ceres witcher. Ceres you to cooperate. I can imagine how. Or his crack page you to smear my name. What did you say? Calm yourselves. After what I saw on Speaker Rock, I trust the witcher. More than I do you. You've that right. But it's no proof of my guilt. And there's another piece of evidence. Got one more piece of evidence. A letter from Berna to Arnvald, instructing him how to spike the mead. It lacks my signature. It lacks my seal. But perfume soaked through the parchment. A very strong scent, you know. Hmm. Still to be sensed. <laughs> Is this your proof, lass? Is this what you call evidence of my supposed treason? Don't make me laugh. I think it's Burn pretty obvious. Right, Saris. Is all precious little proof of her wrongdoing. Alas, your brother Hjalma also has not presented anything that could clear your family's name. We've but one path left to us. Olgar, Lugos, it's time we quit this damn castle. Come, we must decide what punishment Clan on Crate will face. You're making a big You're mistake. Making a big mistake. Silence, wanderer. Wait! Mother, you bade me to leave the hall before the feast. Why? Son, not now. Why did you do it? 
How did you know? Hi! He stands silent. You gave Ceres no credence. Gave the Witcher no credence. But you must give credence to a son who accuses his own mother. Hmm. What was her doing? She shamed herself. Me. The family. The clan. Svan Rika, I did it for you. Only for you. You admit to this deed. Nearly turning the skin the in the oil. I cleanse the name of Clan on Crief, and you, Burner Bran, I sentence to death. You will be chained to a rock to perish of hunger and thirst, and sea fowl will peck apart your remains. Well done. I think we chose the right kind of route for that. Yeah, I really do. It was quite a good outcome. Are we now done on Skellige though? It's actually been really nice out here. Story wise. I had a lust for power, I knew this. But so strong as to commit such a crime. What about Svanriga? What's his fate? He'd lose his home, his name, his honor. He'll choose exile. Or death. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again? No need. Again. I'll not hmm. take any more of this modesty. This is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And now, I must ride for Gedine, for the Jarl's council. Time to pick a king. What that do you is think? Time to pick a king. We'll get the nod. Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberation. Well, let's gladly do it. I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. Well, let's see if this is going to be cutscene or whether I'm going to have to make my own way there. Oh. Ah, stretching. Looks like we're just going to find we're out. Just in time. They've already started. Mm hmm. King Bran back to the sea. Today, our mourning ends. Today, by the grace of the gods and the clans, a new ruler takes the crown. Let us swear her fealty. Me too. Some would see another in my place. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you hmm. to help me fulfill that dream. Ceres! 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 Lumos isn't very happy. There we go, guys. Let's see what we've just been given. We've been given something else. Death from above. Ad attack power. Adrenaline point gain. Bonus experience. From that. Let's, let's uh, throw that there. Well, that was on the floor. Simple. Alright guys, well, thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then, uh, yeah. Like button. If you have any comments, drop them in the comment section below. Any suggestions whatsoever. I love reading those. Thank you ever so much.